Hey guys, this is Mark Goldberg from Mark Vlogs Watches, and today I have a special treat for you. I'm going to review one of my watches. It's a Rolex, it's a Submariner, and it's for sale. So if you'd like to buy this 16613, we should talk. But first, let's do the quick fist watch check. And here she is. Well, naturally, I'm wearing the Rolex in question. This is the Rolex 16613, the famous bluesy. It's a Submariner in two-tone gold. And we're going to talk a whole lot more about this watch. So let me flip the camera around, go over the watch, and then I'll show you everything that comes along with it. Then we'll talk money. We'll talk price. We'll talk filthy lucre. We'll talk about how you could be wearing this watch within a week. Okay guys, well here she is, the two-tone bluesy. Now she's a little bit wet, so if you see droplets of moisture on her, that's because I just gave her a dunk and um, cleaned her up a little bit. You can see she's got a brilliant blue sunray face or sunburst face, dial. I think we call that a dial. All right, let me, let me wipe off some of that water. Okay. So we have a beautiful sunray dial. It is a little hard to appreciate in this studio lighting, but I'll throw up a couple of stills so you can get a better look at it. Well, one of the notable features of the bluesy, of course, is that dial and the sunburst dial that you see there. It changes so much in the light that it's, uh, it, it just shines when you get it out into um, direct sunlight. And then, of course, if you're in a formal occasion with indoor lighting, it's a whole lot more subdued, but it shines outdoors, doesn't it? She has a unidirectional rotating bezel, a blue aluminum bezel insert. Uh, of course, the crown and the bezel are 18 karat gold, as are the hollow center links. Now, this is a U-series. It is a 1999 watch in terrific condition, especially considering her, considering her age, much like myself. She is a holes case. She is still in quite nice shape. She is by no means over polished. Case back is in good shape. So is the clasp. She does have a dive extension, which is there. So it'll fit right over your wetsuit, which I'm sure you're going to wear a gold watch when you go diving. I know I, I wouldn't. This is a lovely watch and I have enjoyed it, uh, but it has largely been a safe queen. I've taken it on a cruise a couple of times. I really, this is kind of a way of dressing up the sports watch and I have really enjoyed it. The but is, I gotta make room. I've gotta thin the herd, guys. I bought this Sky Dweller quite recently. And now um, I would kind of like to pay for it. <laughs> so the bluesy is going to go to help pay for the Sky Dweller. Now the, the bluesy is going to go direct to you for $7,725, which I think is quite a good price. And there's better news other than that the watch is in terrific shape. And um, so let's take a look at some video of what comes with this watch, because guess what? It's a full set, box papers and accoutrement. Let's take a look at what that includes. Well, this Submariner is a full set, so it comes with a lot of stuff. You can see the wallet. It's a green leather wallet. You could hold all your records for the watch in there, or frankly, you could use it as a proper wallet. To the left, that white paper, which says 16613 and you, and then the covered up number, well, that is what they call the papers. That's the warranty, the original papers. Then, of course, there's booklets about how to use the watch. There's the chamois and the pillow and the box, all the hang tags, the outer box, the inner box, everything. You get absolutely everything that came with this watch. Now, when you open up the warranty papers, it tells you when and where the watch was originally purchased. And I think this is super cool. I really love it. This watch was purchased in Paris, France in January of 1999. That is its origin. So this watch, hey, I know it's a Swiss watch, but re really, it's Parisian. It's French. It's from Paris. I should charge extra for that. Taking a closer look at the wallet, you can see that this is virginal. It's completely new, absolutely cherry. And um, I, I, I like to preserve these things, but you could use this as an actual Rolex wallet. It's a beautiful billfold and it comes along, it came along with this watch and it goes to the new owner along with all the other accoutrements in this full set. 
Well, let's take a little bit of a, another look around at some of the little bits and pieces that come with this. If you like to collect things, this is quite a nice vintage set of everything Rolex. This is back in when the boxes were actually leather. And, you know, the chamois is actually leather, and it's meant to uh, buffer polish your watch without scratching it at all. Here's another look at the complete collection along with the watch. You know, the Rolex is a pretty tough watch, and in this case, the gold dresses it up just enough to make it nice for going out occasions. But you can still dive and swim in this watch. I've enjoyed it, and I hope you will, too.